This is a very simple question. Why? What has gone wrong? But Governor Ron DeSantis wouldn't even let me finish asking my question. Take a listen. Governor, Governor what, what has gone wrong with Governor? What has gone wrong with the rollout of the vaccine that we've seen phone lines jammed, websites crashed? It's a lot of demand. I mean, I think at the I, end of the I, day, we, excuse finish, me, excuse if me. I could, if I could finish my question, you just said what has gone wrong, so I'm answering the question. If I could complete the question, though. So you're going to give a speech, or are you going to answer, ask a question? With all due respect, Governor, you I'm asked the question. To, I'm going to answer it. I'm trying to finish my you're question. You're not. No, you're 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 giving a speech. You asked the question. I am trying to ask you the. You're going to ask how many questions? You get three? They only got one question. Why do you get three? With all due respect, Governor, I'm just asking if I could finish my question. You didn't. You my, finished the question. I did not. My full question is what went wrong with the rollout of the vaccine when we've seen phone lines jammed, websites So you're crashing, repeating your question. To complete it for you, Governor, we've seen websites crash and also senior citizens waiting overnight for the vaccine. Where was that at? We've seen it in Duval, Broward, Orange, and Lee County. And why was, like, in Lee, why did that happen? Did you investigate that's, why? That's my question to you, Governor. You're the governor of the state. I'm not the governor of the state. Okay, but you didn't investigate why that happened, like, in Lee County. Why, why was there a big line? Did you did you investigate why? Could you tell us because why? Because we, we distributed vaccine to hospitals, and, and the hospital said, first come, first serve. If you show up, we'll do it. So they didn't use a registration system. There wasn't anything that was done, and there's a lot of demand for it. So people are going to want to so go ahead and, uh, no and get it. So are you saying there was no plan then from the state to make sure that senior citizens didn't wait outside overnight? So the state is not dictating to hospitals how we're not dictating to Carlos Magoya how he runs his operations here. That would be a total disaster. These guys are much more competent to be able to deliver health care services than a state government could ever be.